What do you think? Oh, Bob, this drive through for my milkshake bar is going to be wonderful. And it will all be ready to open at tea time, Chef. Great. I've invited the Spring City Rockets to be my first customers. See you later, all. Bye, Bye Chef Daddy. Daddy. Bob, can I tell them now? OK, team, before we start, Leo has something to say. What is it? Today, I'm going to film you all building the drive through Oh, a film! I've always wanted to be in a film! Uh, why? Why are you filming us? It's for a college project. I have to film a build from start to finish. OK, Bob, let's start. Huh? Smile, give me lots of energy and action! Oh, right. Um, can we build it? Yes, we can! Don't just dig and scoop. I drill through tough ground and break up hard rocks. I like to think I'm the star of Bob's team. Oh, Scoop, that was brilliant. You're a natural on camera. Thanks so much. Wow, I'm a natural on camera. Ooh. Hey there, I'm a Scoop. A natural on camera with loads of talent and amazing sports car good looks. Wait, if I'm this good on camera, then I should be the star of Leo's film. Hmm. <laughs> Once the green paint dries, we can start on the next part of the build. Don't worry, Leo, I'm here. Huh? Hi there, folks. So, what goes with a new drive-thru and a milkshake bar? That's right! A new milkshake menu! Scoop! Scoop! Thanks for the cheers, guys, but I'm still on camera. I don't think they were cheering, Scoop. Huh? Uh-oh. Uh oh, no! I messed up! And it's all on camera! Scoop! We better clean up the paint before it dries. Oh, how can I be a star if Leo stopped filming? Hi, Bob. Hi, Wendy. The drive through window is all ready now. I just need you to install the inside intercom, please. No problem. But how about a break first? Chef Tatty said we could help ourselves to a milkshake. Brilliant. I've always wanted to create my own milkshake. Now, what should I put in? Two bananas, a sprinkling of raisins, loads of peanut butter, a oh. squeeze of lemon... Uh. Ooh. And a spoon of wobbly jelly. Really? All those ingredients? Together? Just you wait, Wendy. This milkshake is going to be smooth and delicious. Hmm. Hmm. Wait! I forgot the ice cream and milk. Now it looks smooth and delicious. Smooth? Yes. Oh, but not that delicious. Um... Paint dry. Check. Arrow's done. Check. So, the next thing to film is... the building of the curb that will separate the car park from the drive through Hey, Leo! You should film me breaking up the ground to make the new curb! It'll be great! Thanks, Scoop, but I haven't filmed Muck yet. Aww. You want to film me? Are you sure? Just tell the camera how you clear away dirt. Oh. I, um... Um... I... Uh... Don't worry, Muck, I've got this. As you can see, breaking up the ground makes a lot of mess. So we have to clean up after ourselves. Scoop! You're gonna hit the... Oops! Oh. Intercom unit. Uh-oh. Oh, 
D don't worry. It's, it's just a little bump. It it'll be fine. Ah! I'm clearing... Um, dirt. And I'm pouring cement. Then we'll put large stones on top of it to make the new curb. Oh, but I'm the one with the talent and good looks. There. The intercom is ready. Great. And now it's time for a milkshake. You're not going to make another one. Don't worry, Wendy. This time, I'm going to make a simple strawberry milkshake. What could go wrong? <laughs> oh, <laughs> I forgot to put the lid on. Hmm. Oh, it's almost time for the opening. How am I ever going to be the star of Leo's film? Hi, Scoop. The Spring City Rockets are ready to be the first drive through customers. So, where do we go? This way, Betsy. I'll show you. <gasps> That's it! Hey, Leo. Betsy and the Rockets are here. Why don't I lead them through the drive through for your film? Oh, that's a great idea. This is going to be the grand finale. So let's make it the best bit. OK. Get ready, everyone. The drive through is opening. And action! Welcome to the new milkshake bar drive through First up, the menu! Wow! This looks brilliant! What can we order? Cool! Uh-oh! Scoop, you're blocking the way. Everything OK? Of course! Uh, everything's fine, because, because Chef Tatty will now ask for your order. Whoa! Oh! Watch out! Oh. 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 oh, no! Sorry, everyone. Oh, are you all OK? We're oh, fine. Okay. Stand back! <gasps> Betsy, Scoop, reverse out of the lane quickly but calmly. There. Now it's safe. I can't show my teachers this. My film's ruined. I'm sorry, Leo. I should have given the intercom a proper check when I bumped into it earlier. But I wanted to be the star of your film. So, I didn't. Scoop, we all make mistakes. And sometimes a part of our building work is fixing those mistakes. Hey, I know. Leo, you should film the team fixing the drive through Then your film will show every single thing that can happen on a build. Oh, brilliant. Come on, everyone. Let's get fixing. Bob, I'll take you back to the yard to get a new front for the menu board. But, Scoop, don't you want to be a star on camera? Fixing the drive through is more important. So come on, let's go. for my project, Ooh, except a team photo. Right. Come on, guys, move in and smile. I really don't like cameras. Oh, I do! Scoop! I can't help it. The camera loves me. Ah! 
I've been meaning to get these spare tires tidied up for ages. Well, Curtis, once we build this tire shed, you'll be able to keep them all out of your way. Fantastic! <laughs> Look out, Bob! I've got it! <gasps> Phew! Thanks, Bob. That one nearly got away. Morning, all. Where are we going today, Bob? Next door to Curtis's garage. Curtis! We like Curtis. We're going to build Curtis a tyre shed to keep all his spare tyres safely out of the way. Instead of lying around where some people keep tripping over them. People like you, Leo. Um... yeah. Tutor? We've already got the materials for today's job. Ah, but these are your general supplies, Bob. Wood, cement, gravel and bricks. No. Oh. This delivery was supposed to arrive tomorrow. It arrived earlier than expected, Wendy. I can't take it back, and this is just the first load. Don't worry. We'll deal with it, Tuton. Wendy, Scoop, Dizzy and I will go to the garage and begin building Curtis's tyre shed, while Leo, Lofty and Mook can put away the delivery. Can we store it? Yes, we can! of lovely, fresh, crunchy gravel for me to shovel. <laughs> oh, Pilchard! Look out! Merc, <gasps> we're supposed to be putting things away, not making masses of mess. Sorry, but Pilchard got in my way, Lofty. We have to be extra careful around her. Here's the second load of supplies, Leo. OK, Tutan. I remember delivering supplies in the Sahara Desert once. It was so hot, it almost melted my... Pilchard! Whoa! A pilchard? Careful! Leo! Pilchard stuck on the roof! Hey, Pilchy, Pilchy, Pilchard. I'll catch you. Come on. Cats are good at jumping. Oh! Oh! Ugh. Uh, meant to do that. I don't think I can carry on if Pilcher keeps getting in the way. What if she gets hurt? I'll shut her in Bob's kitchen, Muck. She'll be safe there. <coughs> Where shall huh? I put the empties, Leo? Uh, maybe somewhere out the back, Lofty. We can sort them later. Righto. <laughs> Pilchard! Shoo! Muck? I thought you put Pilchard away safe, Leo. I was just shutting the door. There. She's safe. There. Ah, oh, good. That's all the walls finished. We'll need Lofty to lift the roof. Oh, Scoop, can you go and fetch Lofty and tell him we need him here, please? No problem, Bob. Finished. Pilcher can come out now, Leo. OK. What's going on? We had to shut Pilcher inside to keep her safe and out of the way. Oh, no, she's not there. She got out again. <gasps> oh, no. I told her to shoo, and now she's run away. <gasps> oh, oh, no! no. We'd better find her. Let's go. Pelchard! Kitty! Pelchard! 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 Kitty! Kitty! Pelchard! Where are you? Perhaps she's stuck behind all the new bricks and timber and stuff. <gasps> then we need to get her out. What's taking Lofty so long? Uh, I'd better check. Oh, Pilch is not here. And it's all because of my shoeing. You must have really scared her. Oh, we can't tell Bob that I've made Pilch run away. He'll be really worried about her. Lofty! <gasps> ah! 
Didn't Scoop say I needed you to lift the roof onto the new tyre shed? Oops! Sorry, Bob. Forgot to tell him. Uh, why is it taking so long to put the supplies away? Um, oh. uh, um. Well... Uh, never mind. Let's get both these jobs finished today, guys. We can do it! Come on, Lofty. You're with me. OK. If we find Pilcher quickly, Bob will never need to know she was missing. We need to look everywhere. Let's go! Where are you? Pilchard! 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 What are you doing, Mark? Huh? Shh! I frightened Pilchard out of the yard. But I mustn't worry, Bob. I need to find her. Ooh! I'll help you. No! No sign of... No sign of what, Dizzy? Oh, uh, No sign of us finishing any time soon. <laughs> hmm. She's in the car wash. She might shrink and be the size of a hamster. No, she's not there. <gasps> Perhaps she's gone back to the yard. Strange. How did that start up? Pilchard. Pilchard. Ah! I guess the supplies are all put away now. Here, 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 Kitty. Leo? Oh. Shouldn't you be supervising back at the yard? Um, yes, Wendy. But uh, I need Lofty to look into some more heavy lifting. Really? How heavy? Uh, you need to come and look, Lofty. Oh. I'll look, Leo. Very important, that. They're all acting very strangely today, Bob. Hmm. Pelchard! Pelchard! Please come back. We miss you! Oh! Oh, no! <gasps> the yard's in a worse mess than ever. What's really going on? Well, er... Uh... Mark? Oh, Pilchard was getting in the way, so I told her to shoo. And now she's run off. And I'm sorry, Bob. We didn't tell you because we didn't want you to worry. I don't think Pilchard would run away, Muck. Cats do wander off, but they like to come home eventually. <laughs> Especially at mealtimes. Maybe if we put out some sardines, she might come back for them now. Good idea. Pilchard can usually smell the sardines as soon as the tin's open. <gasps> I can hear her. But where is she? Meow. Oh, she was asleep in your dumper, Muck. You were keeping her safe all along. I never knew my dumper was so cosy. Now, let's get these jobs finished. She's gone again! Bob, that's brilliant! We're all done. What do you think? Fantastic! I do love a place for everything and everything in its place. Me too, Curtis. Bob! Huh? He'll just disappeared again. Huh? Oh. Ha! She's found a new place to stay safe when she's outside.
<laughs> now she's got her own wheels, she won't get under yours. 